Hi guys, and we're not in the garage right now. So what I'm gonna do is I am finally ready to give you a updated tour of my sacred space, which happens to be my room. You like my little poo? <laughs> He's bank. Oh my goodness, I'm so shaky. Hold on a second. So anyway, I'm going to give you an updated tour now that I've kind of fixed things up and changed things around. So here we go. Ta-da! So when you come in, this is the first thing you come to, my lovely little witches here. And then my this is like my ode to Simon because... I always think of him with the skeleton and, and the meditating. And actually, the bag, those are uh, crystals that Simon had sent me. Also, the magician box uh, that I won on a giveaway from Simon. So, um, yes, this is my Guan Yin altar. Um, this is to her. And then over here, we have my new updated shelving kind of which now goes all the way to the ceiling so the uh the painting on the left or i think it might be on the right for you guys the one with jack and sally that one my guy had commissioned by a local artist for me for my birthday last year and then the other picture is from a theater friend who painted the picture for a play and I fell in love with it and after the show was over she let me have it so um, I just absolutely love what it depicts um, of course my protection elephants and then we come down I'm gonna move in a little closer here I think all right so I got all my piggy banks and stuff but here we go okay so this is what I call my creepy shelf. This is all my creepy decks. Oh, what's that I up me duck doing in there? <laughs> that doesn't belong there. That belongs up with the elephants. So I'll have to move that. <laughs> then we go down and I have it by like, um, I have all my animal decks. And then I have um, like my collections like Atlanta Fairchild. Colette Baron Reed. I've got even more down here, my little guy. And then on the very bottom two shelves, those are all like books, 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 books. And because of my addiction, look what I have had to invest in. <laughs> Ah, yes, there's Sherlock, my beloved Sherlock, and that's his little Watson. I've decided to call him Watson, I guess. Um, my portrait of Rex Riveter, if you guys listen to podcasts and you like uh, film noir and uh, detectives, give uh, Rex Riveter a listen. It's really good. Whoop. We're going to come down here. Get my little bears, and I got some little ones there. Of course, my I am the poo queen, and my skeletons. Now, I'm going to swing around. Look at this tall cabinet that I've had to get because of my addiction. <laughs> okay, I'm going to swing around here now and show you the other side. Um, and yes, the bed is a mess. Poo and all. Because I usually don't make my bed. <laughs> so up here on the wall is the first painting uh, that I won from my soul sister, uh, Jennifer Willowind, the Thrifty Witch, and her husband Peter. And Peter painted that for me. Um, it's gorgeous. I love it. And now the best part, my newly decorated altar. So this is it, guys. I'll give you a close-up, but this is the big picture of it. Um, in the middle is the altar box I got that was handcrafted for me by Jennifer and Peter, as well as um, <laughs> I also won uh, 
my my tarot card and Peter painted me that that hermit portrait so um, yeah here we go so I do keep some incense in the bedroom usually I use that when I shower uh, here is my jar of just extra stones that I've just kind of all put in there together I showed you these guys from from downtown they're made of palm fronds um, I've got some more st stones and things this is a uh, prosperity mix salt this is my candle that Laura made me I've got all my goodies and stuff here my stones my crystals I have uh, my altar tools here, my Kernunos. I'm going to turn that over because those are names of people who took part in the healing circle. So if you took part of the healing circle, you can now see that your name is, is on my altar and uh, in front of Kernunos. And uh, he is providing protection and healing and love for all of you guys. So here's more. More stones and stuff. I got so many stones and stuff. This is kind of like my chakra corner. I've got like four sets of chakras over here. And then, of course, here are my animal totems. I have all but one of my totem animals here. And these are from uh, New Mexico. These are all Zuni, uh, Zuni animals here. Of course, I have to have my... Um, Himalayan salt light, which I absolutely love. And then I always have, I decided to um, use these flowers. I found these huge flowers, and I can't remember the name of them, but they were in different colors, and I got them to represent the seasons by the color. So this is my spring flower with the, with the green. And, of course, uh, a better close-up of Peter's uh, artwork. I just love it. Absolutely love it. And of course, this delightful uh, altar. Um, most everything you see in it, uh, it came with the kit. And uh, I just love it. Alora's candle, which is fabulous. And um, yeah, so there is the updated version of my sacred space. So I'm gonna turn around. Hi guys, I hope you enjoyed the tour and uh, much love and I'll see you next time.